so give me two claps and a Ric Flair. Woo! Because Patriot League Lacrosse is back on e Somewhat of an experience difference in goal today, Chris, because Maryland brings the table Logan McNaney, the two-time All-American and the most outstanding player of last year's NCAA tournament. Meanwhile, Loyola has a first-year starter in Luke Stout. Pretty good test for your first start here this season as you take over between the pipes for Sam Schaefer. Well, no doubt, Glenn, but you and I discussed this prior to this face-off that uh, Luke has had not only a great fall but a great preseason. I think they're very optimistic about how he's going to play today. Team all, all met while he was here, first-team All-American in high school. Brennan dodging inside, gets free. Luke Stout protecting that near corner. As they say, when you're a brand-new goalie, that, that first save means everything. And Stout looked stout there, Glenn. Look at you. 5% right conversion on the extra man. Where do they want to be? I, I think 42% is, is actually very good. I mean, if you're pushing 50, that's that's outstanding. And remember, last year, Loyola was a team that started really slow offensively. Had high at Navy, of course, the quarterback for the football team, as well as talented offensive player. Big shot from a pole. Boy, what a rip that was. Glenn, but no, no reset. Multiple, multiple possessions here for Maryland. Bounce shot, Stout going low. Great save. No oh, ball's loose, but good job of coming in and helping out in that sort of panic situation by Alex Bean. Multiple possessions for Maryland. You know, in succession is difficult for Loyola. It will be difficult for them to handle. So it's really a uh, matchup that that suits them best. Lindsay moves it back to the middle. Fake from Higgins. And go wide. Look at McNaney, well out of the cage. That's not a bad shot. Offside low. Great save there by McNaney. I love the shot there by Higgins. Flex. Luke Stout already five saves on the day for the Greyhounds. And that has helped a great bit in keeping Maryland off the board so far to this 2-0 advantage. Kind of got on my own terms, I guess, and felt like I accomplished everything that that I, I wanted to in this game and pass it on to the next generation. These guys are keep getting better and better. So um, it was, it was what you absolutely cannot do is an unforced error there nope. that gives Maryland the ball back and then now in transition. A save from Luke Stout as he denies Dante Trader in transition. Great look. Particular was I don't, I don't think he's afraid of anything. Like I don't think there's going to be any world in which he's going to come in here today and be concerned as that low shot will be denied by McNaney. Good save on the look from Padre. The great hand style of defense. Yeah, I think if you, you make somebody turn the corner from X and score, it's a percentage wise, it's a tough shot. So they can live with it. You know, they're going to get a couple of those and say, do that a little man. What, a, what a run for you. And certainly uh, we'll look forward to seeing you more frequently and, and maybe more visits to the booth as that shot's denied. That sounds good. Go Hounds, 10-9. When the final score is 10-9, you That's remember that the I That's a heck of a prediction. I said it here from Scott Radliff. Great. Unfortunately, they're not able to get the ground ball. His Irksa had a huge game against Richmond. Good movement to the back. Murphy's shot turned aside. And the ball's still loose. And it'll be Stout himself who comes up with it. Just, uh, uh, you know, it seems like a small thing, Glenn. I can't. And the other big number that jumps off the page, nine saves for Luke Stout, making quite the statement as he moves into the starting role here at Loyola this season. He, he looks to be seeing the ball very well, but he has incredibly quick hands. But, Glenn, I don't think that Loyola continue to operate like this moving forward. They're going to have to give him more help. Directory, that shot. Irksa restarts it, fires it back up top. Trying to get free, Spanos has it knocked away. It's on the turf, not picked up, however, this time. But Maryland now has the matchup that they want. They got the switch. Long was open, but he wanted a better shot. However, Stout denies it. Flag is out. Maryland's going to have an extra man opportunity. And if Loyola hangs on, it will be remembered for some time. 9-6 game, quick faceoff win for Weirman, but a great trail check. Well, I, 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 that's a dangerous pass thrown by Stout, however. And then here, chance to continue working the clock and grinding this one away. Ah, bad Don't know shot about that there. shot, yeah. Bad shot there, as you can see. What, they, what Merrill likes to do is, is Jeopard's gone. This Brennan. Is. Brennan backs off, now engages. 
Moves the middle and open Kelly, but right in the stick of Stout. Have a day, Luke Stout. How critical was Luke Stout's play in the first half in order to keep Loyola in this game? Maybe some of the second half hasn't been as spectacular, but in that first half, I, I thought he was the difference in why Loyola was in this thing. And they beat the ride inside and right in for the goal. Malt sends up well wide on the shot. If you're Maryland, this is just about must convert and Luke Stout again. No one there to back it up for the Terrapins. Luke Stout's fired up. Luke Stout has been a monster today. This is so far away from the cage. Like there's just no need to try to go for the hero check at that point. Inside Stout again on the doorstep with a denial. Yeah, but you, you got a critical point here. Maryland now, this fourth period, Glenn, where Loyola has played a lot of defense here in the second half. And when your legs are tired sometimes your mind becomes tired not there Hughes gets the ground ball stout another save Brennan just put so much pressure on your goal on extended the double comes and Brennan's in trouble oh, wow what a job of getting that the malts and then stout again come on Luke stout here's where the trouble starts he denies long this time. Can the Greyhounds clear? It's been an issue. Cam Wire's trying to take it upon himself. Dangerous picks it up cleanly. McNaney attempts to come over and get it. He's well out of the cage. Lindsay picks it up. Maryland has substituted McNaney. Yeah, Teddy Dolan comes in. And that may be, he may be the more athletic of the two. Dolan, 5'10", 178 pound graduate student in Garden City, New York, by way of Garden City High School, and a transfer from Binghamton. Important here to be organized if you're Loyola. Maryland's gonna shoot and shoot quickly. Bouncer, Stout handles it. Took a funky hop. And Weirman, you see, a capable shooter. They didn't have a problem with him being the one taking the shot. They leave him out there a lot. And you have when you sit on the disappointment of being left out of the NCAA tournament a year ago. And he said the exact quote, Chris Gunkel, I think they're gonna see Loyola's best shot today. Turbs throw it away. And that's kind of the day it has been for the University of Maryland. What a performance from Loyola. I, I think it's certainly an unbelievable performance by Loyola, but certainly an unbelievable performance by the coaching staff. No question. They had a plan, they executed, but they got these guys to buy into it. And when things were tight, when it was 5-5, you thought, here we go. Then they're up 7-5, and they just kept playing. And they kept playing smart. 